Honorable Chief Guest, uh, His Excellency Mr. Nicholas Pep, uh, Public Affairs Officer, two years Embassy Dhaka, International Advisor Professor Marshall from Winthrop University, USA, uh, International and National Executives of GIST, Honorable Alumni from Home and Abroad, and all the invited guests. A very warm welcome from GIST family. It is a great honor and privilege for me to welcome all of you in this summit. GIST stands for Global Educators Initiative for Sustainable Transformation, is a non-profit charitable foundation which started its journey just one year back. Although we are like a newborn baby, but our work at national and international level has kept a notable impact in the society. So we have worked uh, in the, for the Rohingya children through our School of Hope, which works uh, for the students of age group 6 to 12. We have launched ES Award, which is Youth Environmental Ambassador for School. We have launched Global Competency Award, where more than 10 countries participated and 120 schools participated in that program. For the very first time in Bangladesh, GIST organizes exchange workshop with religious teachers about CVE, counter violence extremism. At present, GIST network is active in 14 countries, where 392 state alumni are working with more than 5,000 registered members as the change makers of the society. GIST works not only with the state alumni, but also with the future alumni, that means non-alumni teacher and students. Now about Global Summit. So in Global Summit on Education, this is the first effort of GIST to host an international summit. But this is the first of its kind with the in the history of Bangladesh to organize an international summit focusing secondary and higher secondary levels. In this summit, 150 participants from 15 countries are joining, out of which there are 94 state alumni. The two-day long event includes four keynote presentation, 20 individual presentation, parallel session, brainstorming session, global state alumni meet, ES and global competency award event, international cultural night, and many more. And we are very glad to inform you that one of our alumni, which now honorable minister in water resource, will join in the second event today.